girlies and welcome back to my channel as you could probably tell well obviously you tell you can tell by the title of this video but this is episode two of styling my hair with my new dyson air wrap um yeah but um in this episode is curly edition so we have my diffuser here now I want to say one thing before we get started. This diffuser, like I have long hair, like I have long thick hair, y'all. See, you see that? This diffuser can go like short, like let's see if I can set it back up. But like, if you keep turning it like this, I don't even know which way it is. I think you can it this way to make it shorter. But um. Anyways, the point is, I don't know if my hair will fit here. Maybe when it's wet, it will. But for now, um, let me just go wash my hair first, and then we will try out. Um, I'll do my curly hair routine, and then we'll do the diffusing. So yeah, so you guys, my hair is washed. Okay, I am back. As you can see, I've washed my hair. Now I'm going to quickly do my curly hair routine so that my hair doesn't dry alone because it dries really um quickly. So first, obviously, leave-in conditioner, curl cream. You can never have too much of this. You actually want your hair to be like stiff um when you finish applying it. But yeah, you guys know the drill. I mean, if you don't know the full drill, then make sure to go watch my video on styling, doing my curly hair routine, my full curly hair routine. See that? Stiff. Gotta make sure to get in your roots. And then the other side, also I hate this bottle because you have to like get it all to the bottom and then you can, doesn't even come out that much. Like I swear, I hate it. It's so hard to do it with one hand, but oh god, I'm getting like hairs mix mixed in here. It's kind of annoying, but that's the struggle. Um, but yeah, just get it all in there, break it in. <coughs> Don't mind me coughing, guys. Totally not sick. No, I'm actually not sick. I just allergies, you know? Okay, next step, mousse. If I can get it open. Okay, I might have to dry my hands for this because my hands are literally wet from all, the, all of this. I finally got it three years later. Now, this is the crazy part. Put it all in your roots. I don't for this. Hold on, let me like stand up. You gotta make sure you hear that fizzy, wet sound. Shake it in. Okay, I'll see you guys when I'm back. Then we gently put the hair back. Get my seat. I don't know how to put it all the way over there, but um, I know that I still have some in my roots. It's kind of complicated, but um, anyways, <coughs> now we have gel, and I'm running out sadly. So I think we're gonna have to do a. I'm gonna keep trying out different curly hair products because I feel like. I mean, the only one that I don't is like famous is like this one. But next time I might get like the, okay. Um, sorry if I say this wrong, but ooh, way. I'm just gonna say way. Um, I'm gonna spell it out there. But um, I've heard that is like a really good curl cream. I mean, it is a little bit expensive, but you know, as long as you have perfect curls, that's really all that matters. But also guys, um, remember how I got like um, a carotene back in like August? Yeah, so it lasts um, six months. So I won't have like my regular 
natural curly hair back until like February, which by the way, my birthday is in February. Uh, take a guess what day. Um, if you're real, you'll know my birthday um, date, but I'm not saying it here because y'all could be, y'all could cheat. So anyways, um, yeah, but now it's our favorite time just to scrunch a lot. Um, so yeah, this is basically just like a short curly hair routine, but the main point of this video is me diffusing my hair, trying out the diffuser. Um, and I have watched a few videos on diffusing, so I think I got this, y'all. Um, so yeah. I'm just gonna keep scrunching here until my fingers fall off and I will get back to y'all. Okay, three hours later, finally finished scrunching. Um, so anyways, um, let's actually get to the real part, the main point of this video. I'm trying to like um, dry my hands off because they're like sticky from like the gel um, and everything else. But here is our little diffuser that you already saw. But um, I think this is as long as it goes. See, so it's not that long, but let's just hope it works. I'm gonna attach it. Um, like that. There we go. It's attached now. Not falling off. Um, so we're gonna put heat. Um, wait, where's the heat? Oh, there it is. Heat. I want to put it like all the way, but I don't know if my hair is going to... I may or may not have just dropped the gel. Anyways, I don't know if my hair is going to be happy with that, but we're just going <clears> to... <throat> I'm going to start like hovering over it because I've heard that's what you do first to like control the frizz or something like that. I don't know. So, um, I'm going to... I'm going to search up what setting I should put it at. So, I'll be back in a second. Of course, I cannot find any videos, so I'm just gonna trust my gut and start <clears throat> with. I'm just gonna switch between heat and cool because that's what I did one time when I diffused my hair with the strainer, which is actually the. But it was really good, so let's see if this can beat strainer. Because, of course, with the strainer, they were shaped kind of weirdly, but. Oh, well. So, fan is gonna be in the middle because I don't want it to be too loud. Um, so, yeah, uh, let's. Start first by hovering just for like two minutes. I don't know. <coughs> Sorry, I don't know. crunch out with this oil because the gel makes your hair crunchy and the oil is just going to make it look more soft and natural and yeah just not crunchy so you, you can like re-scrunch your curls just like fluff them up a bit so you want them to be fluffy you don't want them to be crunchy <clears throat> but I think the diffusing time it took me like 15 minutes maybe because my hair wasn't that wet so yeah you also want to scrunch up here in the roots and as you can see it is kind of frizzy I need to like learn how to make it not frizzy but <clears throat> natural curls are frizzy so I guess it looks more natural this way maybe but yeah um see Look at the difference. This side is so more, so much, I cannot, so much more fluffy than this side. So let's do this side now. Just get like a few drops, like three maybe, then rub it into your hands, and then just put it all throughout your hair and scrunch and 
do all that stuff. <clears throat> Also, don't put, don't put too much in your roots because it might look like you have greasy hair or something. You want to spread it out evenly throughout all of your hair. Um, but like, I'm sorry, guys. I couldn't like show you like all my feeding process and the things like techniques that I did <clears throat> but I'm just gonna show you now without the without it being on because that's why like it was just like too loud and I didn't want it was just gonna be too chaotic so basically what I did first I hovered over it which I did show you that I did that for like five minutes maybe like two and a half on the side and then two and a half on the side it's not exact but whatever <clears throat> I hovered then I started picking up pieces from the roots like that and holding them there so that the roots could dry, move it around a little bit, you know. Then I just started actually diffusing. Um, but as you can see, my hair like doesn't really like go in. <clears throat> Cause this is like, I feel like these little thingies are like too short. <coughs> um, but yeah, I just did that, moved it around a bunch. I did um, like turn, my hair like that at one point so that I could get like the roots of this side good and then uh, roots of the other side good um but yeah that's basically all um now <clears throat> this I feel like this definitely turned out better than the last time I did my credit hair routine because it didn't even like work and it was not <clears throat> voluminous yes I finally figured out that word guys I know you're so proud of me um but they're actually like pretty voluminous now. I think it like could have more volume at the top, but we will <coughs> figure that out next time I do my hair. Um, so that is it for today's video. Um, the next there will be one more episode of this, I think, which will be with. Oh, that sound it hurts me. This um, thingy, this voluming brush, just to like make layers defined. I don't know how you say it. Um, <clears throat> but I'm just gonna like keep scrunching so it can be like more fluffy because I really want it to be like fluffy and voluminous. Um, but <clears throat> I think that is it. And thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will. <clears throat> try to do a more detailed guide maybe just let me know in the comments tell me if this was a detailed enough guide for you guys <clears throat> i'm gonna make, try to make sure that the comments are on because lately my comments have been turned off and i don't know why it's kind of weird but anyways thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video